咁嚟緊咧就會咧，我哋移師咧去到呢個黃大仙區嘅，咁就由聖母書院嘅同學咧為我哋介紹一下，到底我哋平時香港人中意參拜黃大仙廟嘅地區附近嘅空氣環境係點樣咧？有請。Good afternoon, Professor Lau, teachers and fellow students. We are S5 students from Our Lady's College. The aim of our project is to study the air quality at our school. It was conducted from November 2017 to May 2018. The amount of nitrogen dioxide, ozone, and black carbon in the air were analyzed. We believe that the air quality at our school is better than those in Shamshir Po, even though our geometrical locations are similar. Here is the geographical environment of our school and the air quality station at Shamshir Po. In the left diagram, the red circle is the location of OLC, and yellow lines represent the main road, such as Sha Tin Pass Road and Shangfeng Street. And the red circle in the picture on the right shows the air quality station at Shamshir Po, while the, while the yellow arrows are Lai Kok Road and Yan Chao Street. Here is our methodology. Three samples were collected each month. The collection time for NO2 and ozone is from 2.10 to 2.30, while the one for black carbon is from 9.30 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. The data collected is compared with the official station's data, that is the Shamshe Post station. These are the flow meters of our, of our, to measure the three of the pollutants, which were located at our chemistry laboratory on the third floor. After sample collection, we carried out chemical analysis in our chemistry laboratory, followed by data analysis. And this is the result of ozone. The blue line representing the ozone concentration of OLC, and the red line represents the ozone concentration of Shamshe Po. We can see that the amount of ozone at OLC is the double of that in Shamshe Po sometimes. It may be due to the surroundings of our school are different from those of the SSP station. Ozone is formed when nitrogen dioxide Nitrogen oxides has a chemical reaction with the volatile organic compound, VOC. We believe that the main ring source of VOC comes from the car repair shops nearby, which are circled in yellow. And we can see from this picture that the car repair shops are quite close to us. These shops release VOC when they are painting and cleaning vehicles. Another source of VOC comes from the main roads nearby. The diagram shows you that when nitrogen oxides and VOC react together, we'll form ozone. And the second result is the nitrogen dioxide. The red line is the NO2 level at Shamshui Po, and the blue line representing the NO2 level at OLC. And we can see that their trends actually are similar, but the concentration in OLC is higher than that of the Shamshui Po air quality station. For the certain level of NO2, they may come from the facilities nearby, such as the Wang Tai Sin Temple, Diamond Hill Funeral Pillar, Jun Sai San Ban Yi Gun, and Diamond Hill Columbarium, Jun Sai San Fo Zhong Chen. At Wang Tai Sin Temple, the NO2 may come from the burning of incense sticks, and at Diamond Hill Funeral Pillar, the pollutants may come from the burning of Joe's paper. For the React for the pollution at the Diamond Hill Columbarium, the NO2 may come from the release of the dead bodies are burnt.
from these three graphs, it has shown that the concentration of nitrogen dioxide increased with wind speed, temperature, and pressure. Especially when the wind direction from west, we have a higher level of nitrogen dioxide, while, which may come from the bus terminus at Chokyun. We had a, an exceptional high level of nitrogen dioxide on 25th of January, made due to the high frequency usage of the funeral parlor nearby. According to our phone consultation, there were usage there were, there, there were 11 funerals on 25th of January, higher than the average daily usage, which is less than 10 funerals per day. The high usage of the parlor and therefore the columbarium increased the, em the emission of nitrogen dioxide when burning joysticks and dead bodies. Together with the wind from the east on that day, nitrogen, nitrogen dioxide level on 25th of January was higher. Here comes the result of black carbon. We can see that our air contains lots of carbon particles. We analyze the red, green, and blue color of content in the samples, as well as the size of carbon particles. We found that the most of the carbon particles were of size PM10, which is 0.0001 cm. And they may come from the vehicle exhaust, tire abrasion, and construction sites nearby. To conclude, the, the ozone level at OLC is moderate, while the NO2 level at OLC is acceptable. We will have a low level of carbon, black carbon on rainy days. And that's all of our presentation. Thank you. Just one day that you have a record high kind of a Palau or, or the funeral services. If you want to further verify this uh, relationship, how, how are you going to design your study? Uh 再compare一個是正常程度的葬禮,都有寫到平時正常是多少,這三個程度就可以得出真實的影響是怎樣。Oh, does it? 